Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I thought I'd just film my day. It's just a random day. I have got work today so there will be a little section without me filming. But it's actually been a while since I filmed and I do apologise that there was no video for my second channel on Wednesday. I think getting back to work and my irons love again I just completely forgot. Too tired to do anything. So I do apologise but it will be up for this Wednesday. So this morning I have done a bit of a workout, I mean like 20 minutes, which is like, I did one fitness martial video, I did a blogger late, like pop pilates workout, because I don't really like yoga and pilates, but that one makes it a bit more fun. And then I did half of a Pamela Reef, I want to say, the name is, just to like half a dance because I need to get ready for work, and I know I wanted to film this intro. So it's 9 o'clock now. That's a pretty productive morning for me. I need to leave in about three quarters of an hour. So I need to get changed and have a proper breakfast. Because I only had a few, like, hoops this morning for breakfast. And so I need something when I first get up. But I don't need to leave till, like, quarter to ten to get to work. For quarter to eleven. Like, I need to be at work. So, yeah. I thought I'd just vlog my day. Because I really, I have really miss filming. But I just haven't even thought. And there's like a few bits I need to get done today. So I was like, mm, good day to film. But yeah, I need to get dressed because I need to shut up. It's not been talking so much. I love it in the mornings when I can open up my windows to... Open up my windows? Open my curtains, draw up my blind and see this. Look at all the lambs. They are so cute. It just makes me so happy and it's like a little positive start to the day when you see all the lambs and they're so cute. I'm using some setting spray just because I've got a tiny bit of makeup on because obviously I'm working. But obviously with the mask it just comes off so it just helps it to stay on a little bit and it doesn't all rub off on the mask. <laughs> but I'm all ready for work. My hair is annoying me. I have to let out but I will see you in the cut park. made no difference. You can't see me. Okay, I apologise about the bad lighting. This is terrible. But I just put up at work. Oh my god. What if you see my eyes? <laughs> Okay, I just told you. I just pulled up and I've got my drink, which is actually still warm from my left home. But I've got a little bit of time now before I need to go in. As you know, I like to get to places early. I just want to say thank you so much for the love from my last channel. My last channel for my last video because I uploaded about my thoughts and feelings about going back to work. Going back to work has been fine, but the love and support I've had from you all, like always, has just been immense. So thank you so much. I really do appreciate it. And there were so many lovely comments and, like, messages of, like, encouragement and stuff. And it does help. Like, I don't do it to get attention or anything like that. I just wanted to make it clear. But I just want to help others. And even if it's, like, one person who feels alone, like, they feel like they've been helped, like, that is all good. And like that's my aim but thank you because it does help it does mean a lot i do read all the comments and reply to them so thank you but i don't know what to do <laughs> to be honest like in this time i generally just tend to go on like a coloring app on my phone just because it passes the time pretty quickly and i don't have loads of data and i can't go onto the wi-fi anywhere in this car park because it's a bit too far from all the places it could be so yeah people are probably like why is she talking to herself in the car again I'm back! I'm talking to myself in the car again! After work when I get home I think I need to tidy some of my room because I mean it is all a mess. I'm not even going to show you it. It's that bad. I really don't want you to see it and I like open about everything. So yeah. I will um, tidy that when I get back. I, will... I need to do it all though. I'm only going to do a small section at a time because otherwise I'll get overwhelmed and it doesn't work. I got some good news, so I don't know if I told you in my last vlog or not, but my hairdryer broke, I think I did actually, and I haven't had one for like a week, so I've had to be like braiding my hair, and the other day I let my hair dry naturally, it took all night basically, it was horrible, and my hair is so flat, 
but I've just had a message to say that it's coming today and it was supposed to come Saturday so I'm like wow Jeff so luckily mum's home to sign for it so hopefully I can wash my hair tonight and use a hair dryer honestly you don't realise how much you use things until you don't have them and you're like mm, this is like really bad so yes that's actually drying my hair later like what fun hey guys so I just finished work I had a dizzy spell at work it was I've never had it before I'm assuming it's low iron but I was super dizzy like I just I wasn't even dizzy I just felt like I wasn't there but I was so I had some food and then I felt sick and then that went so I'm gonna drive home now I'm feeling better everything's like still I've stopped shaking <laughs> but yeah that was not fun so my vlog for the rest of the day will be a chill vlog it is like quarter past three so i'm just gonna have a chill evening i think but yeah i'm really warm because i've got my fluffy jacket on but yeah i'm just gonna go chill at home i think i've got my tea now i'm having curry and naan bread and it's very nice so i will catch you after to show you my new hair dryer Look at that little face. Sorry about the lighting. Light is actually on in my room. My hair is a mess. It does need a wash. And I think I'm going to tidy my bed. It's a bit of a mess right now. I'm not going to lie. So I think my focus for today is my wardrobe. Because a lot of that stuff that's folded up to go into the wardrobe. Or hanging up. So I'm going to do that next. There is some clothes on a chair I need to put away. And then at least I know that that's one section of my room done. Then I can focus on the rest. And yes, I'm out of breath because I just came up the stairs. <laughs> yeah. I think that's the plan. So here's a little before. And that's the after. I am so pleased that I've got that done. Because it's been something that's been bugging me for ages. Especially with the rest of my room. So I will sort that out at some point. But I'm just going to do baby steps. Because if it's too much. Then I want to do so much at the same time. And I won't get anything done. So that's probably the best way that I do things like this. And it's a great tip. Like break it into small sections. And then it does end up being done. Quicker and more like efficiently and effectively I suppose. I just want to say that it is still the same day. I just put a hoodie on over the top of my top that you saw me in earlier. I think I've had like three different outfits on today, but I just wanted to explain that it is all the same day. I just had a few outfit changes. <laughs> so I thought I would show you how the vegetables are coming on outside. Coming to the greenhouse. I think I showed you it all a couple weeks ago. So I thought, a bit of progress update for you. So we've got carrots beetroot we have planted another row of each got peas don't know what that is all that courgettes come in beans and sweet corn whole bunch of tomatoes from last year more tomatoes from last year and then we've got the peas these are all spring onions growing in here and there is something else planted as well waiting to come up through but yeah there's definitely lots and lots of tomatoes so we just leave the plants to die when they've got a few leftover tomatoes on them and <laughs> all the seeds have decided to plant and grow so those for us so i need to put in the trees look how much they've come on so i think in the one vlog you saw me putting them taking them out so i'm gonna put them in now so for the trees i think there's two apple seeds are patty trees so they'll grow to like my height just a bit more so there's two apples, a pear, a cherry, and maybe a plum, I think it is. I think we need a new hammock. The hairdryer has come. So I have got the Babyliss Smooth Radiance 2200. So that's like the what? It is such a nice colour. My current one is black, and I that was my first hairdryer I ever got. Although, the concentrated nozzle is plastic. My current one is the same material, I'd say, as the hairdryer itself. So this one, it does warn you only use it on a low like speed setting. This one has got two speed settings, or two temperatures with three speed settings. So it's a bit more confusing. I think it is a salon one because it's a three meter cable and it talks about salon stuff. But it's supposed to be really good for frizz control. I need frizz control. And then obviously it's got the cold thing, but 
But this one's like set your hair. Never used it. Yeah, the cable is three meters. It sounds a lot when I looked at it. I was like, actually, that's probably the same length as my hair straighteners. My current hair dryer would probably reach from a plug down there to like here. Like it, it is quite short. But I've just done the job, it's just I can't move where I dry my hair, whereas with this I could literally dry my hair anywhere in my room. <laughs> so that is definitely a good thing. But yeah, it's supposed to be ultra fast drying, salon performance, super frizz control, and customised drying because obviously all the settings. So I will be using this later. I just love the colour. It's not too heavy because obviously I'm like here for ages. Um, it is a bit heavy. Compared to my current one, I'd say, but it probably is like very similar. But I can't wait to use it because obviously my filter broke off of mine. This one is a twisty one, whereas mine just like pushes in and comes straight off. So hopefully it lasts a lot longer than mine, which probably broke off in the first year of me having it. Um, but yeah, don't let that happen because they can catch on fire. Not that it did happen to me, but it almost did. So yeah, that was. This is really hard to get on and off though. Like, I got it on, getting it off, I thought I was going to snap it because it's plastic, I was like, it's probably a bit brittle. But yeah, sorry, that conversation was very higgledy piggledy. I hope you kept up with me because I don't think I kept up with myself. I think I'm just going to watch some TikToks because mum's washing up, but she says she didn't need help. I'm really tired. So I'm going to watch some TikToks and then when she comes in, we'll watch some telly. Is Taskmaster tonight, so we'll be watching that if I'm still awake then. Hopefully I am. But yeah, I'm just gonna have a very chilled evening. So I apologise if you wanted an energetic me. And I just want to say, I think I am always in vlogs. I am not an ill person. I just have like lots of things going on with me. But <laughs> I'm really not an ill person. But I seem to like always have like an illness in my video so I do apologise it is not a way of me getting attention or anything like that I just happen to be ill or have been ill while I was vlogging so I am sorry but I'll get there so I just had a memory card error but I've just started using this I was very confused I did talk about it and it obviously deleted when I was drying my hair but turns out this is the speed, this is the temperature, it's coming out cold, I was like, what is it doing? Ah, uh, it's heat temperature, that bit. Got it. I've got the concentrate and all on. It is definitely heavier than mine, but I really like it. I really love the colour. Where's my old one? My old one's still here. Yeah, that is so much lighter. And I can actually dry my hair holding this hand now because before this cable wasn't long enough. My new hair dryer is long enough. It's definitely going to take some getting used to but I think it's going to be okay overall but it still feels damp but I feel like I've dried my hair a lot so I just need to get used to the settings I think but yeah it's definitely heavier but I really like it I think. Once I've used my hair dryer a bit more I'll let you know how it goes. 